hello so now I will show you how you can customize your website uh, every pages images contents and other assets okay so at first we have to go our uh, um, domain name slash WP admin or WP login dot PHP page okay then you can see this uh, uh, login <coughs> page and you have to use this uh, login information okay so I use the username and password then I click on login and it will redirect to our dashboard okay so this is your dashboard uh, you can see your all pages in here okay so when you click all pages it will open the all pages section okay then you can see here is your all pages okay so now you have only three page uh, now you have only three page home about and contact okay so here is contact here is home and here is about okay blog uh, and the projects okay it's uh, now hide from the menu but the page is uh, uh, in your pages options okay so you can easily add this and in menu then it will visible in here um, okay but i will i will show you after uh, how you can change the page okay so let's uh, at first uh, we will change uh, uh, from home page so when you want to change anything in your home page you have to click on edit with elementor okay just right click and you can see the open in a new tab or you can also open this um, link in this tab okay but um uh, when this link in a new tab okay then it will open by using elementor okay you can see it's open using elementor okay so if you want to change anything like you want to change the text so which text you want to edit you just click on this text okay um suppose i want to change this text i just hover on it and click on this then you can see then you can see uh, for changes everything in this section uh, you can see a um, left menu okay then you can see content style and advance in content section you can change any content like the text and subheading and the description okay so you can see here is the title this one okay you can change it here uh, and it will change every time okay like I change it you can see the text is uh, visible when I change it okay uh, and uh, for the second heading you can see the secondary heading just click on it then you can see the heading um, uh, highlighted text okay you can change this highlighted text for my other okay and for the description you can um, see on the description button uh, sorry the description tab okay then you can change the description easily from here okay and for this image i use this image as a background image because you have a long image uh, it's you have a big uh, wide it's, it's a wider image that's why you can see here is a lot of blank space that's why i use this uh, <coughs> background image okay uh, so when you want to change this background image you have to just click this six dot then you can see the section will be selected okay uh, then you can change the section content with box to uh, full width okay but I prefer it uh, not need to change anything in here you can just change from style okay uh, so in style you can see this is the image just you have to click on it then you can see the pop-up and you can upload your email from upload files to select files when you click on select file it will open another pop-up and you can see your computer desktop or any folder okay then you have to go your folder what is your image then you can select and like i want to open this image so i just select this image and open when i click on open then you will then it will 
open okay then i will just click on insert media when you click on insert media it will insert in image section okay and i think you not need to change anything like you can see here is image full image size is full position is center right because everything is perfect in here so not need to change anything but if you want to adjust you will just when you change the image it will uh, um, wider or little bit uh, long uh, because it's depend on your image yeah, image with height okay so you can change this uh, position from here okay uh, you can also position it custom okay and attachment so it's need to scroll if you want to fix this you just click on fixed okay but by default it will scroll, it was just scroll and the repeat it's it's a uh, you if you do not want to repeat an uh, image multiple time uh, you can uh, you will just add it to no repeat okay and display size a uh, custom i use here custom for uh, um, for its setting purpose okay you can also change it to auto cover in content mode okay at this one okay so it's a perfect it's a okay and this one everything is similar okay uh, and this one uh, if you want to change the content in this uh, card okay you just click on the info box and you can see the image you have to uh, upload image similar way as previous okay then the content in here and you can change the content from here okay this is the title this one is title serving time and delivering value and uh, this one has uh, description okay you can uh, use uh, description text in here okay for certain things for uh, others three okay and if you want to change the border you can see here is a border okay if you want to change the border color you just click on the column icon okay is is called a column okay just click on column and then you can see the style tab and you can see the border okay here is the border width okay and you will, here is the border radius okay uh if you change it to 25 you can see it's more uh curve okay uh, every corner is more curve okay so you can change it to anything whatever you want okay and you can also change the border width border width and here is your body color okay and this is the hover okay when you hover on it the border what will you want to show the border okay uh, you can change it from here okay so same thing for this and uh, this one also similar uh the f like the first one okay this is the all this is also uh, uh this image also a background image you can see uh no 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 i think it's not okay this is not background image so if uh, so you have to click just on it okay then you can see this is the image okay this one this one so i use here array uh as a simple image not background image okay so just click on it then you can change it from here similar for every time see uh, if mm, the image changing system is similar text changing system is similar okay and this one also and similar goes in here also and 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 same thing for here it's a it's an icon box so if you want you can change this icon from here or you uh, if you want to change this icon box just select by using click okay and then click on the icon box then you can see the uh, changing option here okay just click on the icon box uh, then the pop-up uh, will be open similarly okay like previous one and if you want to change the border similar uh, for previous just you have to select the column and style you have to go the border then you can change it okay here is the border color okay everything is similar and the button you can see here is the button if you want to change this button just click on it then you can see the button text you can change it here and if you want to change the test uh, change the style you can uh, see here is the background type so it is the first color and this is the second color you can see the first color and here is the second color and if you hover you can see the first color and the second color this is the black this is the 
uh, orange maybe okay so you can ch easily change it from here okay and if you want to change uh, your font width height and everything like you want to uh, increase this font uh, size okay so just you know you have to select this option i mean this text i mean this heading and you have to go the style and then you have to go the descriptions okay and then you have to click on the typography i think you can see this this is the typography just click on the typography and you can see the pop-up okay and you you know will easily change your font size like uh, here is the 18 uh you want uh, 20 okay just uh, you can uh, up this by clicking the button all and also if you want you can type it okay you can see the the size is uh, increase okay and if you want you can also change the font family you can also change the font font weight okay it's a little bit bolder mm, and if you want you you can change it to capitalized it's, it's a little bold capitalized if you want you can make it to default so uh, which text you add in your content section uh, that will i mean uh, this transformation will so like uh it's just it's it's just uh it's not capitalized uh it's default so let's let's go to style mm, and the descriptions and i make it 400 i mean which are previous and then just when i click default it will show the style default style okay you can see the nature search every text only the uh, uh, retrieve is uh his first letter is capital but others is always small okay but if you want you can change it to uppercase so every uh, text uh, is uppercase okay if you want you can make it to lowercase if you want it's default okay and you can make it also the capitalized okay uh, if you want you can uh, style it to italic so it will little bit uh, curve okay you can see uh, you can also it's make it default and decoration you can also uh, take decoration use okay it's underlined Whatever, it's, it's a very simple way okay you can make mm, uh, you can add any line height letter spacing so you can see the letter spacing okay word spacing so if you want to mm, more space with different different words you can use the word spacing okay mm, it's very good. so <clears throat> Uh, in body I think I covered everything it's a very simple way to change this everything okay because you not need to add any new, new design okay you just change it uh, from here like here is a, a, a hidden button you you can also delete anything just uh, hover on it or click on it then you can right click and delete you can see the delete option okay so you if you want you can delete anything like if you want to delete this options i mean this section it's a full section so if you want to delete section you can click it by uh, this cross also if you want you can click it um, of right click then you can delete it okay so if you want to delete anything or select anything uh, you can um, uh hover on it mm, i mean the which section you want to delete just hover on it and press right click then you can see the delete options okay it's a very simple so i think um body section is okay uh so we have to go our header and footer if you want to change header or footer you can you can just hover on edit with elementor then you can see side footer and side header just um let's uh, we uh, edit our footer okay so you just hover on it and click on the side footer okay then it will open by using elementor okay 
yeah this is the footer okay because here is a uh, uh, white background because it's a uh, footer and this is your uh, this background is your bodies okay so you cannot see this uh, background color in here okay so you have to mind it your uh, uh, colors okay like here is white so you can see yeah white okay so if you want to change this text just hover on it and simply you have yeah, this is a secondary heading that's why you have I can change it from here okay and uh, you can also change this button you can see here is the button text and you can change uh, any link okay from here you can see this is the link uh, you can also alignment the button uh, left center right and if you want full okay so i make it figure center okay and uh, you can see here is your logo i mean it's the white logo that's and it's background also white that's why you cannot uh, see this logo uh if you want to change this logo you have to go the customizers option you can also go the customizers from appearance to customize okay uh let's click on customize okay let's see how you can edit our how we can change our logo not edit actually and you can also resize your logo by styling okay you can see here is the 60 percent of your total height of the logo okay sorry width of the logo so you can increase or decrease here okay if you want more bigger you just increase the percentage and if you want to um more little you just decrease the size okay very simple and when you click on it you can see the um, uh, heading of the text uh, oh this one so you can change this text by clicking here it's a description that's why you have to go the description you can see the description you can change it okay and here is the LinkedIn button if you want you can change this LinkedIn or you can also add item okay Facebook Instagram anything okay and when you click on item first you can change the icon library you can text also if you want you can link, uh, add the LinkedIn profile okay LinkedIn profile link okay so footer is okay maybe it's a very simple way every way is similar so header is also similar okay and i think not need to change here anything there yeah, because it's it's uh, it's automatically add uh, when you uh, change the menu it will automatically add so no uh, um, header is dynamic so not need to change anything okay uh, so um, if you want to add a menu okay in here like you want to uh, add your another page okay so you have to go just appearance and menu and you can see the pages option just click on view all then you can see your all pages in here like you want to add now uh, your project page okay because project page is done just you check this project page and add to menu okay check and add to menu then it will automatically goes this section and then just save this menu click on the save menu okay and menu is saved now if you want to fudge your cache so you can see the changes okay you can see the projects and uh, uh, it will follow the uh, um, um, uh, instruction by uh, this okay up and down okay if you want to move it uh, second it will go to second it move it to third it has and if you move it to fourth and then save changes save changes you can see mm, the project will be go to the before contact uh, sorry after contact yes you see 
the project and when you click on project the project page is open okay so it's a dynamic you not need to change anything okay so for now I just remove because it's not need now okay <clears throat> so and now the last option how you can change your logo okay so you have to come the uh, general options maybe no uh, no, no. You, you have to uh, click on site identity when you click on appearance and customize then you can see this uh, left side but and you have to go for change your uh, logo site identity then you can see the logo okay you have to remove or change logo okay just click on change logo and similarly you can add uh, like your uh, like and change okay yeah, similarly how you can add a uh, image okay same thing for add image okay <clears throat> then you can change this here uh, if you want you can also add your site title site tagline logo width okay and if you want to change your fab icon you can or site icon uh, you can change it similar of logo just click on change image okay then published when you uh, when you change anything then you can see the published button is visible then you just click on published okay then you can see the changes in your site okay so i think i covered everything uh, because um, uh, image contents um, those all are similar okay so uh, if you can change a image you will change every image from your site if you change uh, your text you can change every text from your website so same thing for everything uh, for every image text and uh, others okay so i think uh, it's it's uh, done from my side if any uh, is well if any uh, thing you want more or if you want to know deep no problem i will uh, text you or i will make another video for you okay so <clears throat> thank you for now uh, um bye bye